So this question says, at a restaurant, in cups of tea are made by adding tea tea bags to hot water. If T equals N plus 2, all right, so I always recommend that you write down any equations that are provided by the question. So T equals N plus 2, where we know that T represents T bags and N represents cups of T. Okay. How many additional tea bags are needed to make each additional cup of tea? Well, let's see. So, um, if I, so what can I plug in for tea here? All right, so I'm going to treat this like a plug in your own number. It's a little bit different than my typical use of plug in your own number strategy. It's just that. If I only have this equation and no information, no other information, I don't really know what else to do. There's nothing mathematical I can do with this t equals n plus 2. At least not that I can see right now. So because of that, I tell myself, well, I wish I knew you know, what t equals or what n equals or what both of those equals. And then I can use that to help figure out the, the answer to the question. Now, by looking at this, I know that t needs to be greater than 2, right? Because I'm going to add 2 to whatever n is. So let's say, let's start with n, in fact. Let's say I just wanted one cup of t. So n equals 1. So if I only wanted one cup of t, that means t would have to equal 3, right? Because t is equal to n plus 2. In this case, it would be 1 plus 2, so t equals 3. So the question says, how many additional tea bags are needed to make each additional cup of tea? Well, an additional cup of tea under my scenario would be n equals 2. Right Now, if n equals 2, t would equal 4, which would mean I just have one additional, right? I'm just adding one extra tea bag, which would tell me that choice B is the correct answer. But I'm going to just try this one more time to make sure it's consistent. If, for instance, instead of only wanting to have two cups of tea, instead I wanted three cups of tea, uh, t does in fact equal five, which means once again, to get that single additional cup of tea, all I did was add one more tea bag. And therefore, I feel pretty confident now that choice B is the correct answer. So don't be afraid to make up your own numbers, especially in scenarios like this where it feels like there's not enough information. If you ever feel that feeling, right, I wish I knew more, they didn't give me enough, what's wrong with this question, where's the missing information, usually that means you're going to need to use or it'll be useful for you to use this strategy.